Hello all and welcome back to High Priest Reacts to Ruby Chibi Season 3 Episode 4 Grim Passengers Let's get this thing started Why you gotta take your medicine buddy? Weren't these the same room? Uh, it is the, uh, pouring one out thing with the coffee. coffee. Dad, you can't just shove the pill in his mouth like oh, a hey, pinata. There's a method. You mean using peanut butter? <laughs> You're so primitive. No, let me demonstrate. Zwei, you are a loved and valued member of this family. We need to take action so that you can live your best life. <laughs> you think that's gonna work on a dog? No, it's just supposed to distract him. Now, take the shot! One shot, one pill. Direct hit! I repeat, direct hit! Can you see that? Oh, God. You girls are so sick. <laughs> I'm impressed. Yeah, you should see how we sneak a peek at our birthday presents early every year. You what? Uh-oh. Uh, secondary target. Take the shot, Ruby. Take the shot. <laughs> 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 oh god, I lost my glasses. <laughs> Release the oh. force. You probably don't even breathe. Don't worry, you can borrow it afterward. I'll underline all the good parts. <laughs> I demand noodles of a delicious nature and in a timely manner. <laughs> this is unacceptable. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm so happy that <laughs> they're continuing that, continuing those jokes. I think you'll find my report quite thorough, if disturbing. I spared no grisly details. Rampant bookstore chaos and <laughs> related mayhem. You got pretty <laughs> towards the end. Oh, I'm sorry. Did you want some? Shameful. Just shameful. I couldn't agree more. I propose a leash and random electric shocks to modify his behavior. I'm referring to the time and energy you two waste fighting with each other. You do realize you're on the same side. Uh, I suppose. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, fine. Go team. Can I leave now? <laughs> I will if she will. Self-control. I will let bygones be bygones. Too slow, Ice Queen. <laughs> that does it. You're dead meat. That is a great. They are fun. Flirting was a lot less destructive in my day. Stop messing with my hair. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I love this episode. Oh, I love this episode. Oh, that was great. Oh. <sighs> I can't drink that last hour enough that my... Oh, Lord. Oh, that was fantastic. That was fantastic. I love that. Oh. Alright. <laughs> but yeah, like I said, I, I love that they're continuing the joke from episode one and the joke, for, the Grim joke from last season. Well, there's a lot of Grim jokes. The one with uh, Marty and Mike. Right, <laughs> about it makes me laugh. Uh, right, okay. But uh, yeah, but uh, have you uh, heard about that RP's getting a new site apparently? Yeah. We uh, announced it, part of it, I believe, in a Ruby AMA. Where they do these things. Well, you know, well, they confirmed that no 
Crow is not Ruby's dad. Stop asking. They, 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 they got so fed up with that question, they actually broke policy and answer just shut up. Uh, we found out the name of Crow's reference. Arbinger. And, uh, but, yeah, yeah, if you haven't seen it, it reminds me a bit of Netflix, really, if you look at it. Just, you know, for our Bruce movie. And unless I misunderstand something, it's going to have things like character bios and a lot of things on there, which I, because they were talking about how uh, they were going to know how they're going to release more information for the, that when some of the people who run the wikis asked. But yeah. Also, you know, I, I know I rant and rave a lot about what he, about how I can my disagreements with what people say about the show. But most of those people I disagree about have I might disagree with I just like they're sometimes outright lying about flaws they claim on the show that aren't there. Usually they're just yeah, you know, lying about things that didn't happen. But I have some of my life flaws that went up Above and beyond the usual stuff to the point that I actually feel bad about how badly I react to most people's, well, bad reactions to Ruby. Cause like, holy shit. Oh. The person's reaction to episode one had them believe, legitimately believe that Ruby must have been a security guard. Working at Dust Till Dawn. Yeah, or whatever that name of that store from episode one. Well, I don't know how they came to that conclusion. That's not even the worst of it. I'd say the worst is their reaction to the, uh, I forget what the name of the episode, but it was the end of John's arc from volume one. Yeah, yes, the pun is deliberate. Where he, where, uh, we find out about Sip. Influences and all that. And somehow, he misunderstands, or no, actually it was she. She misunderstands what's going on and believes that Fear was puppeting John throughout the entire fight. Despite, and when told that wasn't what happened, they start claiming that that, that, that what really happened didn't match what happened on screen or was said at all. Despite the fact that it matched up. That it was explicitly what was on the screen and what was said. And I just like... I just... What do you say to that? What do you say to that level of dumb? Like, I'm not... One to shy away from the fact that Volume One had problems. But when you start making up stuff, when you, your problems with it are things that no logical person would ever even jump to. I actually had to stop reading at that point because I, I I was legitimately starting to get angry that this because like how can you that dumb yeah but anyways yeah sorry just want to admit that and I these videos are basically my Ruby vlogs as well so anyways uh yeah. If you enjoyed watching this video, then please like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you all next week.